Android Gadgets YouTube channel. Today we'll be doing a screen replacement of the iPhone XS Max. As you can see it's fresh out of the box and functioning as normal. And we'll just start by powering it down. And now we can remove the penelope screws. Now for this part I used a heat gun on low setting. You can also use a heating pad um, probably at 70 degrees Celsius. And now that it's warmed up we can start removing the screen by cutting through the adhesive. Now that the phone is open, we'll need our tri-tip screwdriver to remove the covers for the display and power. Now first we'll start by disconnecting the battery before anything else. Now we can remove the main display flex connector on the right here. Now we can remove the 3D touch sensor flex cable. Next we can remove the ear speaker flex cable and then the screen should come free. Now that the supposedly defective screen is removed, we can replace it with a good working one. Now we'll pretty much do the exact reverse of how we disconnected it by replacing the ear speaker flex cable first. Now to replace the main display flex. And finally the 3D touch sensor flex. And finally to reconnect the battery flex.
Now with our new screen connected, we can test out its functionality. It seems to be working so far. Now here I do see some horizontal lines on the screen. That was not visible to the naked eye, so I'm assuming it has to do with the camera frame rate as opposed to the refresh rate of the screen. Now that the Penelope screws are back in, everything is secure and our screen is working fine. That about does it. Uh, thanks for watching. If you guys found this helpful, please make sure to like and subscribe.